The best way to challenge any belief that is based on the generalization, okay, is by asking a <coughs> question that will shake the earth under the belief. So if somebody tells me I want three estimates, for example, what should I answer? Why? Why? But you need to continue the sentence. Right. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I, what I do, I just, I block, I'm, I, I hear what they say and I don't hear what they say. Okay. That's what I'm trying That's to the do. next filter of deletion. So we'll talk about it also. <laughs> okay. We'll talk about it also. <laughs> okay. okay. Because they do the same to you. Uh, yeah. Okay. They do the same to you. Right. Okay. So we will learn how to overcome that. I'll try to learn why they need those three estimates for you. Okay. But, so why do you need these three estimates? Because they don't know if the price is right. Because they only have one price in front of them, they're which is for the cheapest price. which is not always. That's, that's not necessary. They want to compare. They want to compare. They need. They don't want. Right. They need in order to make a decision. We need to compare it with something. It's right. a must. Otherwise, we cannot make a decision. Right. We have to accept this fact that that's what they believe right now. It does not mean that that's what they believe an hour from now. Because at the beginning you believed that the blue box is bigger, didn't you? And it was very easy to challenge that belief. So the same thing, it's easy to challenge people's belief about, let's say, three estimates. How do we challenge belief about three estimates, for example? So the first rule when we want to challenge someone and change his belief, the first rule is that we have to accept his belief. That's the first thing. <coughs> if somebody tell me I want three estimates, I said, that's perfect. If I were you, I would do exactly the same. Why do I say something like that? Make him feel comfortable. To lower the, to resistance. Lower the resistance and make him feel comfortable. I don't want to get into a fight with him. So first of all, I accept what he says, and I respect that, and he must feel that I respect it.